true starter kit. Uh, mangrove Jack. Uh, I've not used these guys before, but anyway. Uh, in case you're wondering, this one I was chosen because it includes 30 bottles. I know you can recycle bottles, but coming with bottles is useful and handy. Well packaged. Down the sides. Okay. Okay. So we have we have the watch, which is where you do your drink. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in there. We have bottle brush, literally, for cleaning of your bottles. We have a bunch of bottles, but there's probably more inside. Or indeed, lots of bottles. Spoon for uh, spooning. All right. Okay, so this is obviously where you do your brewing. Okay, caps for the bottles, more caps for the bottles, more bottles, more bottles, more bottles, more bottles. More bottles. Okay, sanitizer. Mm -hmm. So this is sanitizer to clean your bottles uh, because if they're not clean, you will grow all kinds of bugs. More bottles, more bottles, more bottles. Um, this makes 23 litres, um, just for clarification, 23 litres of beer. A manual for how to brew. You've got your hydrometer, which measures, measures your... No, that's not a hydrometer. That's a hydrometer. Measures your, the density of your beer, and that's how you know when it's done. This is your air trap. It goes through this hole in the top, so the bubbles can get out, but bugs can't get in. This is your tap for down the bottom to get the beer out. Wow. Uh, over here, that's how the beer comes out. Um, sugar drops for secondary fermentation. So once you've fermented in here, you fill your bottle up and you put sugar in here for the yeast for your second fermentation. All right, temperature gauge um, to see how warm it is. Fermentation is very temperature dependent. This is your initial go, blonde lager. Okay, so that's your yeast and mashed mix and liquid malt extract oh i wonder if you need both of those i don't know very exciting and that would be the whole kit and caboodle bottle brush cool <laughs>